Here we have a contract form, which we'll be creating using Serum 4.0 Physio Stencils. We'll just open up the stencils now. First thing we're going to do is drag a new entity onto the page. First thing we're going to do is remove the Administration tab and move the Notes tab closer to general. We're going to give the form a name. It's going to be Contract. Then remove all the unwanted relationship entities. Now we're going to start working on the form itself. For this, we need to go to the tab stencils. And the first stencil we're going to use is the drop down. Drag this onto the form. Select which width it's going to be. It's going to be half. Give it a name. It's going to be contract type. Next, we're going to add a text field. Going to drag that onto the form. We're going to make this one full width. Next, we need to give it a name. It's going to be contract ID. We're going to add another text field to the form now. It's going to be half width. And we're going to give this contract name. I'm going to add another text field to the form now on the other side. It's going to be half width. I'm going to call this one blocker. But if you remember right, this was a lockup field. So we're just going to right click on this and we're going to make it a lockup. I'm going to add one more text field to the form. It's going to be half wet. We're going to call this one Agent. Once again, this is Lookup, so we'll right click and change it to Lookup. Next, we're going to add a drop down. We're going to add this on the right hand side. It's going to be half wet. We're going to call it Status. Going to add another look at this time using the lookup stencil. Make it half flip. Now we're going to call this one agent contact. Next, we'll be adding a section header. We're going to drag that onto the form. Give that a title. It's going to be details. Going to add some fields to this section now. First one's going to be date time. Drag that onto the form. It's going to be half width. And I call that one start date. Going to add another date time field now. It's going to be half width. And we're going to call that expiry date. Going to add another date field onto the form now. going to be half width. We're going to call that sent on day. Going to add a further date field onto the form. That is also going to be half width. We're going to call, going to call it renew day. Now we have a text field. Place that onto the form. It's going to be half width. That's going to be read only, so we've got disabled. We're going to call it duration in days. I'm going to add another section heading now. Place that on the form. And we're going to call that comments. Finally, go and add an in text field for the comments. Place that on the form. Resize to make it fit. And that's it. You've completed contract 4.0.